Yo guys, what's up and welcome back to another video on my channel. I'm Crazy Crook. That was a really quick intro. Shall we do it again? Yo guys, what's up and welcome back to another video on my channel. I'm Crazy Crawfish and today we are playing an oldie Hotel Dash. Sweet success, apparently it's called Sweet Success. Who really knew that, but still. Yeah, so this is a very, 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 very old game, but when I was a little baby child person, uh, it was so fun and I was absolutely amazing at it and I hope I'm still amazing and I haven't played it in years but I was just going through my old games on my computer looking for something to play and this came up. I love it, it's hilarious. You'll see what it is as we go in, literally you're just trying to save a hotel that sucks, that's it, that's all it is. So let's just get straight in and do it. Here we are in the story mode. Uh, this woman, we don't care about her, she's very unimportant. This is the main woman, we love her, this is the sort of bad guy. Got it, got it, got it. Flo, I found the most brilliant way to explain <laughs> Explained. <gasps> I don't know why that's so funny. One eternity later. <laughs> Focus, serious professional. <laughs> Flo, I found the most brilliant way to expand my wedding business. I'm now also planning honeymoons. Congrats! Oh, these are the voices I've got to stick with now. Tony and Vicky are going to be so happy when they see where I've put their honeymoon. Where are they going? Hawaii, Italy, Paris? I don't know why Flo's a man, don't ask. Well, you know Tony, he wanted to stay near his pizzeria, so I booked them <coughs> So I booked them in at the Dinatown Suites. Quinn, have you seen the Dinatown Suites lately? Not since I stayed there when I was a kid. I loved it. It's um gone downhill. Flo, what am I going to do? Tony and Vicky will be horrified. I'll lose my travel booking business. Okay, don't panic. And I think it's cause Tony. Tony, eh, Tony. Okay, don't panic. Are there any other places in town we could put them? What about bowling seas? Too near the shore. Rooms smell like mildew. Crown Estates. Closed for renovations. Dunwich House? No way, that place is haunted. Ooh, ghost scary. What are we gonna do, Flo? Everyone else is booked. I have an idea. How long until their honeymoon? Ten days, I think. Uh, maybe if we could... And then we could... Quinn, with your style and my know-how, we can transform this dump into a dream getaway in ten days. Can I change the voices? I didn't like them, but I'm not going to record that again. Do you like potato waffles? Mm. What are the other options? Chips. Yeah, fried chips. None of you had chips. I had fries. It's different. <laughs> Do you want chips or potato waffles? I don't care, either or. Oh. Hold on. God, I haven't even started. I'm already five minutes into this recording. I haven't actually started the game. This is the Dinatown Suites, and we're going to play. <laughs> I'm not doing the voice. Well, here we are. This place is kind of run down, but I bet that we can turn it around. All we need is a little hard work, and Tony and Vicky's honeymoon is going to be a dream. That is right, Flo. We're going to make it a dream. Right, I'm going to skip the tutorial. I know what I'm doing. Right, ready? This game's so clever. Red goes with red. You got that? You got that? Remember that. And you can... So, people of four need to go in a big room, and people of two go in a small room. People of three will also go in a big room, and people of one will also go in a small room. Get it? Simple. And so basically, this is just how the game goes. And then they have little things that come. So you take them their bags, you take them their food, you burp while you're trying to narrate, which is quite extraordinary. Uh, and then... You get them their stuff and you get what they need and then they give you money and you put their washing away and that's that's literally the whole game. I say and you get to upgrade as you go along. That, that's all I really need to say. So now I've done the talky bit, I'll only show you the funny bits. Oh no! Oh now it's gonna take so much longer. Oh god there. Jesus wet. I hate it when I'm too good for this game. There we are! Done! First level complete, we got the expert. Yep, I'm still flipping amazing at this game. Uh, if we have stars on our rooms, we'll collect star bills. When people stay there, I wonder what we can use those for. Hmm. Oh, look, we can start upgrading. Just a bugger off. So, what the stars do is they let me make the honeymoon suite, which is up here. I don't know if you can see the mouse or not. It's up there. Uh, so, basically, that's the aim of the game, is to get a completed honeymoon suite. So, your best bet is to put all your money into getting stars on the rooms to start off with. See, you guys can work this out, you're clever. What? Oh, okay. <laughs> that scared me, I thought I'd done something wrong. I thought I'd broken it. Oh, just 
tried to click my fingers into the mic. I don't know if you could hear it on that. It wasn't the loudest click I've ever done, but I'm quite good at clicking my knuckles usually. Are you guys, are you guys good at that? Comment below if you're good at clicking your knuckles. That is if you're watching my videos, I don't know. Boom, another level done. Another level expertly executed. Right, here we go, the main part of the actual story. Well, it's time to get started on this bridal suite. It's got to be really special for Tony and Vicky. I'm sure, I no, I don't care about the tutorial. Right, so basically what you do, you get the stars. Oh, I bought some lamps. Oh, now it's a pink rug. We love a pink rug. I'll tell you what, I know the channel logo is blue and everything, or turquoise, whatever you want to call it, but pink is a smashing color. Uh, the ice machine. Oh, I'd never use the ice machine. Who cares? Skip. So, as you can see here, once again, I've just gone for the casual uh, star upgrades just so people love their rooms. It's, it's nice to make the people feel special. They want a good two out of three star room. Why couldn't you come two seconds earlier? I hate it. Oh, rant time. I hate it when they're out of sync because that makes my whole thing out of sync and then I actually can't deal with it. This game gets me stressed. Oh, and now I've been too good for the game. Genuinely, I hate it. I hate it so much. <gasps> a new room. How exciting. That will make this much more difficult. Not really. I can handle that because you know what? I am a professional. That's the most unsatisfying thing in the world. They've all got three stars except that one. Ooh, and now we've got towels and pillows, which means something exciting is about to happen. Not that, they're boring. But her, she's exciting. <gasps> Look, she's different. She is a businesswoman. And so, basically, the whole thing with businesswoman is that she's very aggressive. She needs everything to be really quick. Like, the normal people, they don't really care what goes on. But she needs to be really quick. And she also requires a towel because she wants to go swimming. After a stressful day at the office, she wants to go swimming. And stay in this sucky hotel. But, yeah, who cares? Each to their own. So now look what she actually does down here. This I've already forgotten her name. She's Flo, but couldn't tell you what her name is. Quinn, Quinn, that's it, her name is Quinn. But have you seen how little she actually does? I mean, she just stands there while Flo is doing all this hard work. Lazy. Just that's p laziness, that's all it is. How dare she? Anyway, there's another level. Complete expert. We've smashed it. I'm so good at this. Yes, we would love that lovely wallpaper. Look at that. That is a sexy bed and a sexy sofa to go with it. I'll tell you what, that's already a pretty damn good room. I'm not going to lie to you. Right, okay. Level five here. So, oh, yeah, the gift basket. The big gift. The, 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 the gift baskets. So, basically, I put them at the front of rooms and. Ah! A new room! I put them at the front of the rooms and it basically then makes it all look nice and I get a bit of extra money. But um, what I'm going to do this level, because I've actually realised while I'm playing this, I already know what I'm going to edit out. And I've shown you guys very little of the actual game. So, you're going to see the entirety of this level. Mm, yeah, lucky, aren't you? And also now I've got a cool trolley, which means I can carry more things at once. So, as I said I was going to show you the whole level. Uh, if there's anything particularly interesting, I'll show you, like, slowly. But we all know where this is going. It's going to be sped up. <laughs> <gasps> it's the evil one. See, I told you to watch out for her. See, I told you she was important. By which I mean she does very little apart from turn the damn power off. And this is the only thing Quinn actually does. She stops that woman when she's turned the power off. Good job, Quinn. So now these guys are back in the room, all we got to do is wait for them to wake up, that's what I was going to say. Wow, they woke up extremely quickly. And done! Smashed it, level 5 completed. Look at that lovely lamp, that was an expensive lamp. Right, so I'm going to leave this video here guys, thank you so much for watching, I hope you like this get. There was an alarm telling me to fill out a form, which I've already done. 
but this is only the third time we're going to try the outro. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed this game. Let me know if you want to see some more of this game. I know I only did five levels, but I feel like I got quite a lot of comedy into this, so I'm happy with it. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, remember to smash the like button, smash the subscribe button, and smash all the buttons you need to comment. Tell me what video you want me to do next time. And remember, stay crazy.